What is up, y'all? It's your girl Maya, and today I am getting my first ever bikini wax. I'm scared, y'all. About to get this wax, and I'm so scared for my life. Me too. <sighs> Y'all, it's a beautiful rainy day in Atlanta. And today I decided I'm going to put my big girl panties on and go get a wax. You know, I've been a shaver all my life, but, but to be completely honest, I'm over it. I want to see what the hype about the waxes is. Never got one in my life. I know it's going to hurt, but... Y'all are going to come with me along the whole entire journey. So I just got ready. I'm about to head to my appointment. My appointment is at 610 and it's in the city. So I got to leave right now because there's definitely traffic right now. If you live in Georgia, you can relate. So we're about to head over there, y'all. I might stop and get some food. Like, I'm starving. I don't know. I'm scared for my life. But we're going to talk more in the car, y'all. Let's go before I'm late, girl. Just pray for me. Okay, gang, gang, gang. So obviously I'm in the car, I'm on the highway, I wanted to wait till I got on the highway, you know, so we can just be cruising and talking. So the wax that I'm getting is a sugar wax. It's the one my friend recommended. I know like there's the other one where you like peel it and rip it off. But she was like, girl, don't get that, get the sugar wax. So I found on Instagram this waxing bar. It's, I think it's called like Fuzzy Peach or something like that in Atlanta. We're finna see how it looks. It looks really nice. I didn't want to go to no little corner store, you know. <laughs> I'm not about to play with this wax. Like, I need it to be good. So, I feel like this is really dark. Hold on. But I'm not about to play with this wax. Like, never. So, yeah, we're finna head there right now. Like I said, never in my life have I gotten a wax. I've just been like, I don't know. I feel like when I was younger, like 15, first of all, people was getting waxes. And I'm like, y'all parents letting y'all get a wax? Like, never. I was shaving, shaving, shaving. I still shave, but I realize, like, shaving is so annoying. Like, my hair grows back. I keep saying, like, shaving is so annoying. My hair grows back so fast. Like, I'll shave, and then three days later, it's all back. Like, where did you come from? Like, where did you come from? Nobody asked you to come back. So, hopefully, this wax lasts. I'm definitely going to be asking her a lot of questions in the process. So, if this is your first time getting waxed, stay tuned because I'm not afraid to ask questions. And I'm a very open person. Like, I really don't care. I'm not scared so much about, like, the, oh, you got to open your legs and do all that. I'm scared of the pain. You know, I'm scared of the pain. So, it is what it is. I'm, what, 20 minutes away. I'm going to get there one minute early. I was going to be five minutes late, but you know what I'm saying. Corvette, Corvette. So, <laughs> all right, y'all. I'm going to keep on listening to my music and paying attention to driving because one thing about people in Atlanta, they do not know how to drive. So, I'm going to talk to y'all when I get there. I'm excited. You're excited. We're excited. Let's go get this wax. Okay, y'all. First of all, I'm really a finesse because I got here just on time. It is 610 and my appointment is at 610. So we got to go inside. But first, we need to mask up. Um, the place looks cute. I like the little, y'all gonna see the logo they got going. So, are you scared? Because I am like, oh my gosh, okay. I just have to, I have to breathe. I have to breathe and I just, I just can't breathe. Like, I feel like it's all mental, y'all. Oh my goodness. Okay, come on. Okay, y'all, here's what it looks like. A little luxury, luxury. I don't know where to go. Where do I go? Okay. Y'all, it's like cute. Like, it's a little cute, cute, cute. Hold on. Focus on me. You see it? Treat yourself. Why am I camera acting up? Cute little waiting room or whatever. Okay, y'all. Uh, like, a big lock is sticking. Are you? No. I cannot. I cannot. Skin clear, though. Skin's very glassy today. I cannot, yo. I might need a pep talk from my friend, cause, girl, uh, let's call her. Cause I'm feeling like, 
a little wearisome. Let's call her, y'all. Girl. Girl, I'm vlog. <laughs> Please, I'm vlogging right now. I'm about to get this wax, and I'm so scared for my life. <laughs> You'll be fine. No. Y'all hear this girl? <laughs> I'm, scared. I'm, so scared. I'm about to get the sugar done. I don't understand. Yes, it's better, right? Mm -hmm. Right. Y'all, you see what I'm going through right now. You've experienced this. Listen, all I know. So tell the tell the vlog. Is it really bad? Like on a scale of one to seven? It's not like. Okay, I'm, okay, this is your first time, so it might be like a seven. But I'm telling you, like, it's not gonna be that bad. Like, after, <laughs> after you're gonna be like, okay, like, you look good. Okay, alright. You have a whole tattoo. You just can't <laughs> wax. <laughs> that is a whole fact, bro. I never. Th okay, yeah, facts. Okay, I'm in there. What? Okay, that. I'm gonna call you out there. <laughs> you got this. <laughs> Listen, valid point. I have tattoos, okay? And a wax can't be worse than a tattoo. So we're fine, y'all. I'm waiting right now. Tick, tick, tock, tock. Yeah, we about to get into it. It's like the hallway of death. Like, no, I'm sorry. The Balenci, the Balenci, the Balenci. But this is real cute. Real chic and clean. Yeah. Um, we're going into the room. And okay, I really like y'all got this decorated nicely. Very clean. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and step out. Okay. You can get undressed from the waist down. Be comfortable. Okay. You can sit your things right in here. Your head is gonna be facing this white wall. Head that way. Legs this way. Okay. I'll come back in and we'll go ahead and get started, okay? Okay. Okay, y'all. So you already know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna see y'all when I'm laying down. Yeah, enough of this. It's honestly me just laying here for me, like the kiss of death. Oh wait. <laughs> I'm hosting. <laughs> Is that enough? No. So y'all, we waiting, we waiting, we waiting. Like, here we go. Like, here we go. I think I hear her coming back. Yep. I'm ready. All right, So you can go in butterfly for me. Okay. So what's like some aftercare? Cause I've. Obviously, I've never got this done. Like, what do you do to? Gotcha. So, Afro wax, your skin is very sensitive. Uh -huh. Um, I tell a lot of clients when you have no hair in the Brazilian area, your skin is prone to a lot of like bacteria. Right, 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 right. Also, it's very important to just make sure you keep the area as clean as possible. Clean, yeah. Um, clean as possible, dry as possible. Okay. Okay. Clean and dry. Okay. Um, the first 24 hours, you don't want to do any working out. Okay. No sexual activity. Okay. Um, just kind of let the area breathe and relax. Okay. And then after 48 hours, you want to go ahead and start exfoliating your skin. Okay. So you can use a loofah, exfoliating brush, exfoliating scrub. Uh -huh. Um, If you do use a scrub, just make sure it's little to no fragrance. Right, right. Fragrance do irritate the skin and cause it to break out. Um, And then you exfoliate at the least twice a week. At the most, three times a week. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Y'all hear her? You relax like this leg a little bit for me. Because I'm just sick of shaving. Like, it is just so annoying. Yeah, and then it's uh, growing back in like two days. Yes. Waxing, you can get a good two and a half, three weeks. Okay. Of wax. So you only get waxed once a month. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So every month. <laughs> So, I always tell my first time clients, your first time is always going to be the worst. <laughs> I don't try to tell anything, I tell it how it is. Okay. Um, But, it's not as bad as you may think it's going to be. Okay. I feel like, like, if, you, if you've if got tattoos, that pain is worse, right? Some people say the wet. No! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> was boosting my head girl you got tattoos you fine you fine <laughs> it's, it's different it's different because it's such a sensitive area so. right. right but it's quick so it's, it's very quick okay. okay so of course the wax is hot 
but it's not burning or anything. You just have to get used to it. Okay. So I do use a low temperature hypoallergenic and vegan wax. So it doesn't have to be super hot for it to work effectively. So that's the good thing about this wax. Okay. So I do, for my first time clients, I do little breathing techniques just to help you get through it. So the lips tend to be the worst. That's why I do it first and get it out the way. Okay. Like, I don't even know what to expect, that's why it's... All right, honey, just relax for a minute. Take a deep breath. Okay, you can relax. Take a deep breath. You can relax. Oh, shoot! <sighs> okay, it wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Like, it was bad, but it wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Gotcha. Okay. If you, if you feel like the lips weren't that bad, then you should just do it. So, I always tell clients, make sure you don't shave in between your wax appointments. Okay. If you shave in between your wax appointments, you're never going to get to a point where your hair gets finer. Uh-huh. And start growing back slower. Take a deep breath. Take a deep Okay, I think the worst is over, y'all. So, I'm going to hit y'all back when it's done and we can talk because my arm's getting tired and I need, like, I need to breathe, so. <clears throat> All right, y'all. She's not in here, so I'm putting my mask down, but I just finished up. We need to talk about this in the car because I need to get dressed and pay her, but y'all, it was a lot going on. It was, it was, we're going to talk about it in the car. I'm going to hit y'all, but I don't want to show y'all the hair. That's just nasty, so. <laughs> YouTube gang I'm in the car now and honestly okay if you have never got a wax before it's not completely bad but some parts definitely had me want to like kick my leg out like, like she said like the lips was the hardest part girl I got past that I'm like okay that's fine and then she got to the top part and I'm like clock out clock me out like sign me out of this place because i can't that like i cannot but the customer service was amazing like this isn't even a sponsored video i just found them on instagram and they looked really cute and professional so if you're in the atlanta area then make sure to go ahead and look at my girls at fuzzy peach the fuzzy peach um i'll put their instagram there whatever supporting a local black business hello and woman woman black woman's business at that so it was honestly a really good experience for my first wax like it was no weird energy like <laughs> like it was it was very comfortable she made it comfortable with anything weird you know and it was just a little bit of pain you know, a, little, a little bit of pain but this is definitely gonna be way 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 better than shaving she's beautiful she looks beautiful so it was a little tmi video but i just wanted to bring y'all along with this experience i know there's a lot of younger viewers out there who have never got a wax or have nobody to talk about this stuff with so you guys know i'm your big sister and i am here to let you know that it's okay if you want to get that wax get the wax if you want to get the wax, get the wax. I'll take you. Let's go on a wax date. <laughs> but thank you so much for tuning in. Again, I love y'all. Thank you for all the love and support on a daily basis. And don't worry, I'll be showing love back. So follow me on Instagram. And I, I'm active, okay? I reply, like, like I show love back. So thank you. I love y'all. And I'll see you next video. Bye.